train station 100 yards from the train station to the entrance to the park somebody was thinking was that you bob One way to wake up in the morning. Wow, that was actually better than the one at Disneyland in LA. I have to say, there's like a whole long part towards the end where it's completely dark. Mm -hmm. um, so that's fun. This is different. Ride number two. Buzz, Buzz Lightyear. Lightyear. I'm kind of concerned it's not going to be the same layout as LA because um, I'm getting really good at knowing all the hot spots and where to aim in LA, but we'll find out, you know? Gotta just do the best that we can in the unknown. Buzz, you're bilingual! <laughs> I didn't even know. For the record, for the record, what? My gun was not working. Ah, I'm a sword. Look at this. Look at that. I'm level six. Level six. Highest score. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! We're at the Phantom Manor. I guess the good luck thing is to touch this guy's tongue. I don't know. I don't know. Presumably it's the Haunted Mansion in Paris. I don't know. We'll see. I mean, it does kind of look like a chateau. Okay, uh, Phantom Manor is about a deprived single woman whose dad 
trying to find her husband. Really weird to be here in Paris and see all these similar things and and rides and like motifs that like of Disneyland, it's really hard to keep remembering I'm in Paris until the characters start speaking French. It's it's fun because they always stop and they say, time to translate. <laughs> <laughs> so they do English and then they do French or they do French and then they do English. I'm going to say they do English first because this is an American company. So what are we doing? Indiana Jones and something, Temple of Peril? Peril, yep. We have a fast pass for this ride. But because the wait's only 15 minutes for the regular line, we're gonna ride it twice. We're gonna ride it twice? Yeah. Wow. Because why not? Because Indiana Jones is my favorite in LA. I mean, so far, the most obvious difference is that this ride is outside. It looks like this is a legit roller coaster. So we'll see how it goes. Indy! It looks like we're in a fast line. Okay, well, that was very different. It was very fast. And around a couple turns, I hit my head really hard on the side. And the loop threw me for a loop. I was not expecting that. So it was, it was fun, but I don't think we'll do it again. <laughs> yeah, I hit my head a little bit. Oh, just felt like I was getting. Okay, we're done. Mickey, Mickey experience is like, three hours right now and um, Pan is like forever, the Peter Pan land. Peter Pan never came back he's just he, he just took to off Neverland? he left yep never gonna happen if you're if you're a four-year-old you didn't make it, get up early it's never gonna happen I like how condensed it is here I mean this is very very condensed we you know we go from one section to the other super fast the only bummer is then you don't get all your 10,000 steps in Oh, we're still gonna get it. We'll still get the steps in. We'll but if you're to... like these kids, you can put the shoes in the front, they have their shoes in the front, and then they sit in the cart. That's the way to go. I wonder if we could pay someone to pull us around, babe. This is actually a ride, it's a maze. So it's a little, little kitty cat maze in the hedges. I like it. So we walked in, they gave her, you know, food preference menu, menu, which is great. Look at this, look how pretty this place is. Oh, nice. The rugs and the, look at this. Yeah. Yes. Are you kidding me? This is legit. I love Middle Eastern food. I love all work so much. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Me too. This is legit. I think I got 28 things, including purple nochi. I got, so cool. I got fish, the there's mochi. sausage, I got two different kinds of chicken, I got samosas, I got these wraps, I got two different kinds of meatballs, I got three different kinds of hummus, three different kinds of couscous, we got feta. I'm really so thrilled. Look at this. They gave me a full allergy menu, so I know exactly what's in everything, and there are so many choices. Love Middle Eastern food, and I'm so excited. I wish the whole world was like this, where it was so easy for me to eat the food everywhere. I am just so excited that they have all these options. I cannot wait. Okay, plate number two. The falafel tar vegan and gluten free. Oh, good. <laughs> I can't unlearn what I just learned, which is olive hummus is insane. And we should have it 
every day and not have regular hummus anymore. I mean, regular hummus is still good, don't get me wrong, but I mean, if I only knew olive hummus existed all these years, I feel like I've been lied to. It was so good and I would come back here every day. We just finished the Star Tours ride. It's bright out right now. And it was the exact same. Exactly the same. Even the girl at the end. Bye bye. bigger but like they actually have castles here so I think they still end up winning that. It's much closer to the German castle though than the other one isn't it? That is true. What's it called? Ah! <laughs> Look you can go inside this castle. It's actually a real castle. It's not a fake one. You can go inside. The Chateau of Belle and the Beast. The lady and the men who was the doormat. <laughs> It's up there. But oh, where's the Starbucks? It's up there, the green umbrellas. I don't know, okay. we'll see it. We'll see. We'll see, baby. If it's Starbucks, I will. I rest my case, it's okay. This should be a Starbucks, is what she's saying. And it's a clothing store. What are they doing? Wow, what a fun day at Disneyland in Paris. Thanks so much for coming with us today, guys. Hope you enjoyed our little Disney adventure. We definitely had fun and enjoyed spending the time with you. So tired. It's so fun. <laughs>